Hello everyone. In this video, we will see the procedure to check fault report in Sifang CSC162 distance relay. Fault report gives you information about the type of fault that has occurred. It also gives us information such as fault current, fault distance, fault duration, etc. So, in order to check the fault report, first press the set button and go to query report. In query report, go to event report. For the latest fault report, click on latest report. Here, you will get the latest report with its date and time. Here, we can see that the relay has tripped in zone 1. It is showing Z1 trip. Also, it is showing that this is A phase fault and it has tripped all the three phases A, B, and C. The atory close function is blocked during this fault and below it, it is showing the fault voltages. VA, VB and VC. Note that these voltages are in secondary. Since it is a A phase fault, the voltage of phase A has dipped to 20 volts instead of 63.5 volts, where 63.5 volts is the nominal voltage. Here we can see the fault current. Since it is A phase fault, the A phase current value is much greater than B phase and C phase. These values are in secondary. The CT ratio of this relay is 800 by 1. So the A phase current will be around 3.2 kilo amperes. The fault location is shown as 9.75 kilometers. So let us now conclude, the important parameters that we have got from this fault report are this is A phase fault and this has tripped in zone 1 region. The fault current is around 3.2 kA and the fault location is 9.75 km. In this video we have seen the procedure to view the fault report in CSE 162 distance relay. So that's all for this video. If you have any doubts, do ask us in the comment section. And if you found this video useful, do hit the like button. Thank you.